Hello everyone. Welcome back. Um, just showing you a little bit of a review on what I'm going to be painting next. Uh, this is the Aspen um, kit. Let me see if I can get that around there. There we go. That's better. Okay, this is the Aspen uh, uh, Reborn kit. This one, guys. Oh, sorry, guys. I have to get my little pup. He's wanting my lap. This one, guys, is um, from the Bountiful Baby, Baby out of the Realborn series. Uh, and he's called Aspen. You can see how he looks. He's a custom. I'll be started painting him next. Um, he's uh, he's not real, real big, guys. He's, he's a smaller. He's not a preemie, I don't think. But he's, he's made more slim uh, rather than a chunky, fat baby. More like a slim baby. See the little legs? They're real slim. And the little arms. He's got some pretty good detail there, guys. You can see one, one hand is closed. Well, the other one is also. Both closed hands. Uh, on this one, he does have one finger up. Um, let's see here on the feet. Let's look at this and see. Whoops. Sorry about that little guy. But... Yeah, the feet is really detailed, guys. Beautiful. Look at the wrinkles in that. Very gorgeous. Oh, yeah. I love the detail on the feet. Great. And then the back of the legs got a little bit of roll, uh, fat rolls. He's just, uh, he's, he's made more like a slim baby rather than a big, fat, chunky baby, you know. He's kind of slim. Um, I'm, I'm out here in my new work area now. Um, guys, this is just my garage. And I turned this in. It, it's not very pretty to look at out here, but because um, we haven't got it finished yet. And to be honest with you guys, I don't know if we ever will get it finished or not, money-wise. It's just we we sunk everything we had into this cabin when we built it. Everything we had, savings and all, and we built it ourselves. And we just sunk everything we had into it. And um, so this is as far as we got. And we didn't get the garage all the, way, all the way completed. So I'm hoping one day, hopefully one day, we will get this finished. But if not, it's okay anyway. It's it's just, it's a work area. So I'm not too worried about that. I'm just going to work out here. I switched it out here. Uh, my son was staying out here. Now I have a, uh, this is a, it was supposed to have been a garage, turned it kind of into a den-like but we never did get it finished, so I have a refrigerator out here and a stove and, uh, you know, stuff like that. And then mostly storage stuff, but I do have that stuff in here. And uh, he stayed out here for a while, and I couldn't do anything with it because he was staying out here. Uh, but he moved out, and so that's how I got to do my nursery. I, I moved all of my workspace out here, all my tables and all my work where I'm going to be painting and all that stuff. I moved this all out here. And I just love it out here. There's so much room out here. The light is much better out here because we've got the uh, overhead um, lights. You know, I don't know what they're called, but they're nice. And uh, the lighting is much better out here. I don't have windows out here. That's the only thing I hate is we never did put in windows or nothing like that because, of course, it was just going to be a garage. And uh, my husband didn't feel at the time that, we should put in windows because it's on the other end of the house, you know, and he was afraid that somebody would be able to break in or whatever because it's all on the other end of the house. But hopefully later on, maybe we'll get all this straightened out. I would love to add a few windows and maybe even some French doors out here, take the garage door down. But anyway, enough of that. I'm rambling on, guys. I'm supposed to be doing a kit review, and here I am rambling on again. Anyway, this is the little Aspen. You can see. Look at the little tiny nose. He's got such a little bitty tiny nose. Oh, he's so cute. He's pretty. He's going to be cute, guys. I think. Now, I haven't even bathed him yet. I've got to put him in a... Starting off, you got to wash him, you know, guys. you got to be sure they're really, really, really clean. Because you want that paint to stick. You don't want that paint to be coming off for your customers later on. But he has got some really cute fat rolls right here. Look at this. And his feet is very detailed. Especially this one, guys. Look at the... I don't know if you can even see that or not, but look at, if you can, look at the wrinkles, how detailed. God, this guy's detailed on his feet with wrinkles. Beautiful. That one, look at that. Gorgeous. Love it. 
but anyway that's him and i will let me show you something else right quick this is my little logan he's already painted he's been waiting here for a while and i may have showed him in a different video but i just wanted to show him to you guys again uh i'll be i'm finally here his there's his little head i'm finally getting his hair in guys it was shipped it should be to me by friday so finally, 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 that's what I say about this guy here that I order the hair from. He he has wonderful hair. It's absolutely gorgeous, but it just takes a good long time to get it. I've had this ordered for probably already now about three weeks. But he is a one man. Um, you know he does it all his. Well, I think he has some combers. Maybe his mom helps him comb and stuff like that. But, you know, and he is covered up all the time because his hair is great. And um, so it just takes him a while to get it out to you. But, I mean, it, it, as far as the hair goes, great, wonderful, beautiful hair. Um, soft, nice. It's just, if you order, you better be prepared to wait for a little while. Because this is one of my customs, and I've had to put this one off and put it off and put it off. And the mom's understanding. She has been really understanding with me. But, you know, I don't like to do that. But I had to. I didn't have a choice. But anyway, guys, there's, there's that. But I'll be starting his hair soon. And I am working on uh, my silicone girl when I get her rooted. I got quite a bit done on her yesterday evening rooting. I'm taking it real slow with her, guys. Because of the, you know, the silicones, the hair is just, it's hard for it to stay in. So I'm trying to make sure I get it way down inside that silicone so it don't pull out as easy. And uh, so I am taking my time with her, but I am rooting her right now, and I got quite a bit done. But as soon as she's done, I'll let you see. And uh, then I'm going to be starting this little guy. He's already painted, waiting for her. I'm going to be starting his hair. He's going to be done in a light, a light caramel blonde. And then this little guy is going to start getting painted after I give him a... He's got to jump in the bath. He's got to have a, great, a good soapy bath before we start his paint. But that's what I'm up to right now, guys. And um, I, I showed a video last of my nursery. I'll be doing updates on it as I get stuff in. Uh, I'm having to wait a little while now, guys, because you know money. We, you know, money makes the world go around, right? Uh, that's the way it goes, seems anymore, anyway. But we're waiting on uh, that. I'm waiting on to get some little bit of more money. And then I'm going to start adding to my nursery, too. I'm going to do a... Um, I want to do like a wall shelf. Uh, really, it's supposed to sit in the floor, but I'm going to see if there is some way I can figure out to hang it on the wall uh, because I just don't have much space in there, guys. And I'm trying to get as much space as I can, but if not, I'll just have to let it sit in the floor. But like a wall unit with uh, like the cubes. And that way I can have cubes to like lay all my babies in those cubes because I'm having, I've got to come up with an alternative of, uh, you know, where to lay babies I've, I've got quite a few and so but anyway and i'm going to get some wall art in, to go in there some of the nursery wall art i'm going to be looking for safari themed ones but in like the the nursery type ones you know like the um, cartoonish looking ones i'm looking for that right now also uh i can get one of those units at walmart for i think like 32 dollars or something like that plus tax but if I can, I'm going to check the yard sale sites first. Because a lot of times people get those things and they just, they don't want them anymore. And, you know, you might be able to get one for maybe 10 bucks or whatever. So that's what I'm going to be doing right now. I'm going to, I'm going to be searching the yard sale sites right now. And looking at yard sales. But then if that nothing, you know, if nothing else, I'll have to just break down and buy one from Walmart. I don't want to put a lot of money into this because, um, you know, if I can buy second hand and it's in good shape and looks good and I get it for a great price that's what I'm going with I mean that's just me guys you know you don't have to spend a lot of money if you want to do something like this if you just look around these yard sales and stuff you can come up with all kinds of stuff but yeah but anyway that's what I'm going to be doing but this is what I'm up to I am going to start rooting him I'm rooting my silicone I'm going to start painting him and I'm fixing up the nursery I am one busy lady, guys. <laughs> okay, guys. Um, please subscribe to me, guys, if you're not already. And share so we can get as many people over here on the, you know, to subscribe as we can. Because I'm uh, aiming for a 1,000 subscribers. And as soon as I reach that, I'm going to be giving a reborn baby away. 
go back a couple videos and you'll see the well quite a few videos because it's been a while you'll see the videos where i I'm, I'm doing that enter there you have to be subscribed and um then i also do a once a month giveaway on a reborn related item it, you know it's just something i pick and choose over you know it might be a onesie it might be a bottle it might be a, a you know a little girl's dress you never know but anyway sorry about that guys check out the check out my videos go back and look at those and enter if you're not already and uh, just please share guys so we can get this baby giveaway it's been a while i know people are tired of waiting i know i am uh, so um you know please share all this if you will and hit the notification bell guys so you never miss one of my videos and as always guys thanks for watching and i'll see you soon in a new video thanks again guys bye bye